そしてのようなものがいっぱい詰まっているのに気づき私はむせながら飛び起きた。Alright, so we got the first gameplay bit in a long ass time. So we're caved in. That's great. Okay, I believe, if I remember correctly, they just sing that song over and over. I'm not going to die. 
がおかしくなりそうな通路の先に気のせいあの誰かいますかThere's a post going around on Tumblr of these, like, school kids. Teachers gave them assignment to draw candlelight, but it ends up looking like some vulvas. It's hysterical. The door is sealed firmly shut. There's no way to open it. No matter how I looked at it, nothing about this place seemed like an elementary school in any way. But there were lights on the ceiling, and support beams to prevent cave-ins, so it certainly wasn't a naturally formed cavern either. I mean, there was even indoor plumbing down here. Well, then just leave the door open. Who the fuck cares? No one's gonna see you. Now clearly, you can see this, this fella here. There are skeletal remains here. It's a small child. Maybe she was hiding? There's a name tag attached to her jacket. Renaissance Elementary School. Mina Nishio. I could hear the voices of children who seemed to be in pain or distress. Yeah, they just repeat. decomposed body. Based on the uniform, this was almost certainly a female student, but age is much harder to determine. Her name tag identifies her as Senior High, Matsukaze Prefectural High School, Tomomi Isomura. Oh, we don't want to go... to the death room. <laughs> well, if we can't, the door is thoroughly sealed. There's no way to get inside. In Japan, you'll sometimes hear this song play when um, when the pedestrian light changes to green. It's so the blind can hear it. 
and note across the street. I don't know why it's that song in particular, though. The door is sealed firmly. Oh, maybe because it does say... Oh, because the translation is like saying, proceed this way, proceed this way. So maybe that's why. Those are the actual lyrics. Oh, didn't make it, buddy. There's a recently deceased corpse here. Her hands are outstretched as if she were trying desperately to dig her way through the wall. There's a student ID name tag on her uniform. Komashiro Trade School. Sexy Hagiwara. <laughs> I could hear children laughing. <laughs> There's a foul smelling rotting corpse here. Based on uniform, it was probably a male high school student in life. He seems to have died sitting down, though he doesn't look very relaxed. There's a student ID name tag on his chest. Karasuyama High School, Yoaki Kamimizu. There's a fully decomposed corpse here. She's wearing a skirt, so it seems safe to assume this was a female student in life. Her name tag confirms this. Shobu University Middle School, Hinako Meguri. I could hear children calling for me, hiding and goading me to find them. There's a recently deceased corpse here. Based on the uniform and various accessories adorning the body, this would appear to have been a female junior or senior high school student. Her student ID name tag is still fully visible. Karayasuyama High School, Shihoko Usaki. I could hear the voices of children playing. Among the voices, I heard the sound of a door opening somewhere nearby. Hmm, which door could that be? Among the voices, I heard the sound of a door opening somewhere nearby. Oh, those laughs sound very, very close.
い洞窟の中でも明かりが全くない真っ暗闇の部屋を見つけた中でピチャピチャ水滴が落ちて反響する音を聞く限りそれほど広い感じじゃない You went with bloop bloop and that drip drip? Without thinking, I smacked my hand against my leg as if trying to knock off whatever was stuck to it. Be so small, a tooth or something? Inside the shoes. Oh, that's the grossest part. Just get, just get. 
ここはきっと屠殺場だ食用の家畜を解体して食肉にする場所だどこかの自然なんだこの部屋の存在は別に不自然じゃないこの血はあの肉片はあの大きな骨の塊は動物のものあ<笑>部屋の至るところに汚れたバケツが置いてある大腿骨のようなものがたくさん刺さっているものブルブルした黄色や白い実のついた赤黒い肉の塊が詰め込まれたもの、so、I'm assuming that's fat the yellow and white liquid それらに混じって私は見つけてしまった人間の腕が数を刺さっているバケツを<笑>人は悲鳴を上げるときは意志の力を必要としないんだ。But hiding where? We、uh, save. No, no. save. <laughs> の中の様子が伺えた
通り過ぎてと願った私の祈りを受け散らすように部屋の中に誰かが入ってきた。恐ろしかった<笑>その男は気絶していた様子の女の子を肩に乗せていた部屋の中央にあるあの血まみれの机に歩み寄ると乱暴にその子を投げ落とした。左腕と自由を奪っていくなんて何をする気なの乱暴に引っかき回し始めた金づちや霧などが床に散らばって女の子の乗せられている机の下にも転がり込む洗い動作でそれを回収するあそこに隠れていたらきっと見つかっていたやがて巨大なペンチのような器具を持ち出して女の子の元に戻ると再び机の上に乗り体の上にまたがった。この方をわしづかみにしギリギリと締め上げる。
女の子の舌をペンチで掴むと男はためらいもなくそのまま一気に引き抜いてしまった恐ろしい出来事に私は言葉通り腰が抜けてしまったでもこのままいたらまたあいつがやってきて見つかったら今度こそ殺されるかもしれないとにかくここを離れようと私は棚の戸を開け部屋に出た溢れてくる悲鳴を必死に噛み殺して私はこの部屋を後にした嫌だ嫌だ何なのこれ夢なら早く覚めて、はい、夢かと期待しても覚めない現実だと理解するには私のリアルを超越しすぎている私の脳はだんだんと飽和状態になってきた物を思考する回路にぼんやりと霧がかかってしまっているナオちゃんナオちゃん助けて<笑>それから何日経っただろう途中で携帯の電源が切れて。私の中で時が消えてもずっとナホちゃんを探し続けた何も食べてない何も飲んでないもう何回も眠っているからきっと数日経っているポケットにはお母さんがくれたチョコが入っているでもこれは私とお母さんをつなぐ大事なものに覚えて食べられなかった。<音声>
<笑>おいしい All right, that was purgatory. The shortest chapter so far. Maybe the shortest one in the game. All right, well, thank you very much for watching. Look at what we've unlocked. Stay tuned for more Corpse Party Book of Shadows, and do please like, subscribe, and fave.